take the gain back a notch by going to the mid gain mode. down the gain control a bit from my very mild breakup. So let's hear that how that sounds in comparison to the clean channel. To mid, uh, the medium gain mode. This fattens up the tone a bit. gain mode all, all, all the while the gain control is set to about halfway <laughs>
So going back to the clean channel. Now we can affect the mids a lot. Um, the mids are a little over halfway. I've got this mid smooth switch in the upper position and that makes the mids a little darker. If I turn that off, now the mids will be brighter sounding. So let's stay like that and go to the mid gain mode. So now let's smooth out the mids. So I'll put the uh, the mid switch back on and raise the mids and you'll get a thick smooth mid range now. So now I'm set in series mode, so the overdrive channel is working uh, in the following way. Guitar goes into the overdrive channel, overdrive channel gets routed into the clean channel. In this mode of operation, all the controls on the clean channel and on the overdrive channel are active at once. They're in series. So the uh, EQ setting on the clean channel will also have a big bearing on the sound of the overdrive. So right now I've turned the bright switch off on both channels. So what you'll hear is a very dark, smooth response. So it's kind of muted. So what we'll do is we'll add the bright switch on the clean channel. Step one. Right, switch position two on the clean So that gives <coughs> quite a bright response. Let's go back to bright mode one for a less, less aggressive top end. <coughs> but let's turn the bright switch on to uh, bright mode one on the clean chat on the overdrive as well. <laughs> So 
So this has less effect than going to bright mode 2 on the clean channel. If we go to bright mode 2 on the overdrive channel, So you can get all different kinds of top end responses by the combination of the three-way bright switch on the overdrive and the uh, three-way bright switch on the uh, clean channel.